This is Kara, and I thought I would show you what I have so far for oh, my light for <laughs> the light by for the I'm a <laughs> oh goodness really really light you can keep doing that uh huh okay. oh okay. Okay, so, so this is, um, I thought I would give an update on where I am with the Dollar Tree Junk Journal Challenge that I'm a Cool Mom is doing on her site, and I have decided to go along because, first of all, you got junk journals and you got Dollar Tree. Well, how can you go wrong? <clears throat> so I went for it. Um, so I've got in my book and, oh look, I have a bunch of stuff in here. All right, and I covered my book, the middle, with a scarf. And then I took um, the handles from a bag that I bought. And now this is going to be my closure for my book. Okay, so this is gonna be two signatures. And right here, I've been making tags and I just kind of threw them in my book because I had another project I was working on. So there's journaling on this side and then this is a calendar. And here's that fabric again. Another tag with a butterfly and some Dollar Tree ribbon. Did a little collage, used the calendar. And here's a couple more tags. All right, so then I've kind of started working on my signatures. Um, there's some more things that I want to add. I want to make some book page pockets. Probably work on those tonight while I watch TV with the husband. All right, so here we go. I used Dollar Tree Washi, which I did not do in my other video because I found it. I swapped something out that I wasn't going to use and I decided to use this. These are the stickers. <clears throat> this is also, um, paper, no, what's it? Fabric washi from the Dollar Tree. They made tabs. This is from that bag. So one of the tags, maybe, I don't know. One of the tags that I make is gonna end up going here. Some more of that paper washi. Here's a tag I made. Kind of did a collage style, used the ribbon. And I use, um, now that I look at it, I'm not so happy. I use this tacky glue. And now that it's dry, you can see it. Probably should have used a different glue. Uh, this book page is uh, paper, copy paper, and I glued two pieces together. And so now I can have a tag up there in the top this paper is super thin. I thought about sewing, um, but I didn't know if that was part of the quote unquote rules. <clears throat> so I didn't, I just glued them, but I think I would really like to go back and sew it. Maybe we'll see. I don't know. Coffee dyed book page from the book, um, a butterfly. And then I bought a coloring book, did some copy dyeing on that. And it is glued <laughs> to what I have back here. Yep, Aileen's and I are not friends right now. All right, I'll fix that. This is from a notepad, me a little tuck spot. And here's another tag using the calendar and some Dollar Tree twine. And this is from the calendar. I want to embellish this a little bit more. <clears throat> you can tell it's not sewn in, it's kind of falling apart, but I just wanted to show you where I'm at. This is from a banner and I just fussy cut it out, stuck it in there. 
Another piece from the calendar. Uh, part of the envelope. Man, see, this is so not in the finished state. Um, this one is a pocket up here, so I'll put a tag, another piece of the banner, some more stickers. All right, so that's kind of the first signature. And like I said, I still want to add um, pockets and stuff. So this is the second signature. And for these tabs, I use more of the banner just to kind of give it a difference. Uh, some white drawing paper. This is a big folder, but I'm going to make this a spot to tuck. And these two will be tucks. And this is <clears throat> glued together on the top, so I can add a tag. Another coloring sheet, book page. This one's just a single, another envelope. Dye paper, uh, another sticker. So, yeah, so I still need to add some fun embellishing to this second signature. But this is where I'm at so far. Kind of have my signatures put together, have my book cover. I am, where did I go? I'm going to add. Oh, where did it go? Butterfly. Hmm. Oh, there it is. I am going to add this butterfly that I fussy cut on to my cover. Something like this. I think that would look so cool. So, yeah. That is after, depending if I try a hidden spine or if I sew right through the spine, that's why I'm waiting because I haven't decided. Um, but that's where I'm at. Still have some more to do with my signatures. And yeah, um, hopefully you're giving this a try because it's a really, it's been a fun project. And it's neat to think of Dollar Tree things in a different way. Um, if you have any questions, um, comment below. And stay tuned for when it's all put together and not falling apart. All right, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.